among many questions that cannot be answered, the most mysterious one is, how is consciousness created? Was it created here on Earth or was consciousness created somewhere else and then brought to Earth by an advanced race of beings? Is it possible that they are just experimenting with consciousness and slowly altering how it operates? How is consciousness created? When did it first appear on Earth, and how did it evolve? What is consciousness, and which animals can we consider sentient? Todd Feinberg and John Mallatt draw on recent scientific findings to answer these questions, and to tackle the most fundamental question about the nature of consciousness. How does the material brain create subjective experience? After assembling a list of the biological and neurobiological features that seem responsible for consciousness, and considering the fossil record of evolution, Feinberg and Mallatt argue that consciousness appeared earlier in evolutionary history than is commonly assumed. About 520 to 560 million years ago during the Ediacaran period, they explain, the Great Cambrian explosion of animal diversity produced the first complex brains, which the first appearance of consciousness is accompanied by. Simple reflexive behaviors evolved into a unified inner world of subjective experiences. From this they deduce that all vertebrates are and have always been conscious, not just humans and other mammals, but also every fish, reptile, amphibian, and bird. Considering invertebrates, they find that arthropods including insects and probably crustaceans and cephalopods including the octopus meet many of the criteria for consciousness. The obvious and conventional wisdom-shattering implication is that consciousness evolved simultaneously but independently in the first vertebrates and possibly arthropods more than half a billion years ago. Combining evolutionary, neurobiological, and philosophical approaches allows Feinberg and Mallat to offer an original solution to the hard problem of consciousness. This was an excerpt of the ancient origins of consciousness. How the Brain Created Experience by Todd E. Feinberg and John M. Mallatt with some commentary of my own. How do you believe consciousness is created? Leave a comment down below and share your opinion with us and others. Thank you for watching.